Right On is a unique spot color matching feature found only in IQ Ultimate. Right On allows IQ Ultimate users to create custom color corrections on specific spot colors, view a complete list of spot colors found in a digital file, print custom swatch pages, as well as rename and save frequently used spot colors. With Right On, you no longer have to settle for bad CMYK conversions that ultimately disappoint your customers and cost you money. Now let's take a look at how to utilize Right On's spot color matching features. And for learning purposes, try to follow along using one of your own print job files. To begin, open IQ and double click the desired job file from the job view window. This will open up the job ticket window. Select the Right On featured tab by clicking on it. The first thing I would like for you to take a look at is Right On spot color list. This is a complete list of all of the spot colors found in this particular digital file. From this list, select the spot color that you would like to make changes to by clicking on it. For my list, I'm going to select this light green spot color to make adjustments to. Now that I've selected the spot color I want to make changes to from my spot color list, I now need to print a swatch page for my selected spot color. To the right of the spot color list, you'll see the print swatch page dialog. In this section, you should see your selected spot color and its spot color ID. If your spot color is not visible, you can also enter your selected spot color's ID in the spot color ID box. Within the print swatch page region, you will also see the print swatch page settings for color range and media size. By default, the color range is set to normal and the media size is set to letter size. In the drop down menu for color range, you can choose from fine, normal, or wide color range for your swatch page. In the drop down menu for media size, you can choose from letter or A4 for your swatch page size. I'm going to leave my swatch page settings at default for now. Once you've selected your desired swatch page settings, simply click the print swatch page button. IQ will then generate a swatch page file for the selected spot color and place the swatch page in the job view window. To print the generated swatch page, simply drag and drop the swatch page file to the desired printer. It's important to remember when printing your swatch page, be sure to use the same media you plan to use when printing your final project. This will help ensure color accuracy. If you're following along, take a look at the swatch page we just printed. On every swatch page IQ generates, you will see multiple numbered color swatches of different color builds found in a selected spot color's density. This provides a visual comparison as well as a swatch number to reference for color adjustments. In the center of the swatch page, you will also see the original spot color you selected earlier, surrounded with a black box. Now that we've printed our swatch page and selected the color value that best matches the desired spot color, we can now adjust the original spot color. Navigate back to right on by double clicking your file, and make sure the spot color you want to adjust is selected in the spot color list. Then, in the change spot color dialog, type the new spot color ID into the change to text box. Right On will then automatically replace all areas of the original spot color with a new custom color. To save any of your custom spot colors for frequently printed jobs, double click the custom spot color and the color information window should then appear. This will allow you to save the custom spot color as well as name it. To access any of your saved spot colors, simply click the drop down menu button to the right of the Change To text box. Understanding the basics of IQ's Right On Spot Color Matching System will enable you to become a true spot color specialist and improve your print color quality. Right On. Control your color.